I've had Pokemon Emerald modded so that every location in the game is randomized. If you step into this house, for example, you might end up in a gym, a Pokemon Center, or even something like the Lugia encounter. The goal is to find all eight gyms and all of the Elite Four members and then beat them in order before challenging the champion. Will we be able to do it? And more importantly, will we be able to do it without getting completely lost? We start our time and space traveling journey by naming ourselves Grill because she is one and choosing Mudkip as our starter. The beginning of the game is unchanged so that we can actually start playing. But after running through the first route, we start our adventure. All right, now we're in Old Dale Town. We should go into the PC. <laughs> yeah, or let's go into, you know, the little hut next door. Oh, okay, that's the magma hideout. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I don't think we want to go there yet, though. Maybe later. So if we ever need to somehow go to the Team Magma hideout, we need to go into the Old Dale warp zone. So we'll see what's in here. Anyways, we'll just like ignore that place. <laughs> oh, we're in Zootopolis now. <laughs> cool. There's a couple things we can do, right? Like we can continue playing the game or we can like go deep into the teleport. I think we beat Brendan first. All right. Oh, wait, remember, I'm like, oh, hey, let's go to the Pokemon Center to heal our Pokemon. We need to find a Pokemon Center. So yeah, I think we're forced to go deep now. Let's find a Pokemon Center. All right, well, we can go into here. Okay, Verniturf Town, which is really good for us because we have a lot more warps here. This is gonna be crazy. That was so lucky. Yes. All right, we also, chat, we don't have Pokeballs, so we can't catch anything yet. Buy Pokeballs. We can't buy Pokeballs because we don't have a Pokemart. <laughs> okay, we found the champion. <laughs> we'll send it, guys. We can get really lucky here. Waylord, level 57. That's fine. Mud Slap. That could do it. Yo, okay. Okay. This is still winnable. Don't worry, we're... Okay, okay, okay. So, dying to the champion was more than just a regular whiteout. You see, the Pokemon Center that we healed at in Verdanturf Town was actually the Evergrande City Pokemon Center. Because we died to the champion, we spawned outside our most recently visited Pokemon Center, which was the Evergrande City one. This puts us in an entirely different part of the map with no way to get back to where we started. Oh no, this is bad. Cause we have Cave of Origin here. But we'll try Victory Road. Dude, wait, are all of these? Okay, Meteor Falls, okay, 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 okay. So how, where do we go from here? Like Meteor Falls is the best place, technically. Oh, the Cave of Origin, the other side. You're right, we're gonna die here. Okay, we should have leveled up our Mudkip a little bit more. Oh, I can't go back in. But you know what you can do? Subscribe to the channel. If you're liking the video and all the other content on the channel, subscribe so we can make big number go bigger. There's no nobler cause than simply pressing a button to increase a number. I'm proud of you. It's also probably a good time to mention that this randomizer will be made available for free for you to play. Just join my Discord, links are in the description and everywhere else, and there should be a channel where it is. Not only that, but it's actually been so popular that we're going to update the randomizer constantly. So you can do this with Pokemon Platinum, Black and White, and basically every other generation. Enjoy and subscribe to the channel so you're notified of when we do that. I can't go back in, but we have a lot of other places now to go teleport. I think we've saved our loss to the champion. The only issue now is it'd be really nice if we got our Pokemon up at least a little bit of levels. I feel like that's nice. Because of this reason. That was a crit. I have soft lock. You can't get a Pokedex to catch Pokemon with. I think we're fine. Like, we can get back. You can still catch Pokemon without a Pokedex. Okay. All right, I'll speed up a little bit. But so far, we've gotten really lucky. Don't kill. Oh my god, this was the ideal trainer to go against to level. Bro, what? The issue, though, is now we don't have any PP for Mud Slap. And we've registered to Uber Lola in the... 
these don't have anything good. Ooh, that's kind of good. Yeah, it's a double battle, but I can't double battle because I only have one Pokemon. Can we clutch this out? Oh my god, we came into these battles at level 6. We're leaving at level 11. We still need a Pokemon Center, though. That's important. Or a Pokemart. What is this? You can't walk on cycling road. It's too dangerous. Please come back with a bike. Oh, please be good. Please be good. Oh, God. All right. Oh, but we white out and we get back to Evergrande, right? Yes. Right. Okay. So Pokemon Center. And then we go through the Cave of Origin again. And Ligma is now healed. But we also lost money. So what if we go in here? Oh, no. The holes. They're one-way teleports. All right. Okay. Fiery Path. Which isn't bad because level 15 is okay. <sighs> We're running out of money. Now we gotta go back. Oh. Oh, wait, wait. So this is the cycling road right here. That's really good. So many more warp zones. We're looking for a Pokemon Center. Wasn't a Pokemon Center in Fortree? Yes, there was a Pokemon Center in Fortree. You're right. That's a great idea. Now we can heal our Pokemon. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 go back. I don't want to do this bit anymore. Okay, there's another warp zone here. Okay. Look, we were just there. Okay, now we're in Sudopolis. You can get back to the Pokemon Center? You can't. This is the other side of Sutopolis. I don't have Sir. So I can't get back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, my brain is going to melt. Because there's so many things we can go to now. Let's go to Rustboro and then get a little bit more levels on our Mudkip. Ooh, you know what? We still need to find a Pokemon Center, though. Because we can't fight trainers really without a Pokemon Center. So we'll start from the bottom in Rustboro and go up. Hi, Dad. <laughs> That's important to know, though. All right, now, Grill, if you want to come straight here, here's my advice. Head to Rustboro City beyond this town. Yeah, 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 good idea. All right, let's go to Rustboro. Nice. All right, where else do we go? <laughs> if we go back in, does he fight us? Oh, okay. So he, we need four gym badges. All right, so we'll go here. What's, what's in here? Speaking of gyms, this is gym three. Okay, so Rustboro is now gym city. We can't face gym three. I'm pretty sure... Until we do, like, everything else. But we got to remember that. Okay, so the building to the right of the Pokemart is Gym 3. But we still don't have a way to heal. That's our issue. And then we need to do this. Right. This is the big cathedral or whatever. And now we have access to Fall Arbor Town. All right, so Pokemon Center. Mosty! Okay. That's so good! The Mosty City Gym is actually Rustboro City Gym. But that's the first gym, though! How's our Pokemon doing? Yeah, not so hot. No, oh, we can't go back in. Oh, no. This is another gym. We found Flannery. Wait, but I'm pretty sure these are teleports. Oh. Oh. Oh, wait, it works. Okay, so we know where the first gym is. We know where the fourth gym. And we know where the third gym is, which is uh, Watson. Okay, so abandoned ship. I don't know what floor this is. What floor is this? Oh, nice. Oh, oh, we can just get back. This is the loop. This is Rustboro. And then we go from Rustboro, right? That's Fall Arbor. And then Moss Deep. Okay, yes! <laughs> this is wild. Okay, so we made it back, but do we use the potion and then do gym one? Okay. Whew. We just water gun everything here. Okay. Oh, um. I think this is probably okay. Now, hopefully this doesn't crit. Or kill us. How much money do we have? Yeah, no, that's cool, man. Hockeys were broke. But now we should be able to beat it. Oh my god. All right, so water gun it is. The problem is that we still need to find gym two. We know where gym three is and gym four. We just don't know where gym two is. And we also need to find a Pokemon Center. <laughs> Defeated leader Roxanne. And we got the first gym badge. GG. The stone badge from Roxanne.
are going to catch any Pokemon. We probably should, but we don't have any Pokeballs or any way to get Pokeballs. So we literally cannot. Hey, we got a Netball. Never mind. We have a Pokeball. <laughs> we can catch Pokemon now. We got to get really lucky. All right. We've checked almost everywhere. Oh, we have checks in abandoned ship, actually. Yes! We found another gym! Dude, there's two gyms right next to each other. Because this, this right here is gym four! <laughs> wow! And we found the Master Ball, boys! <laughs> so let's check out these. Oh! So let's check out the rest of Fortree City. Oh my god, we have another city. Oh, it's opening up again. Because we're in Mauville, we can get to Verner now. And you know what that means? We have a Pokemon Center now. Oh my god. We've gone back to the first loop. So the Pokemon Center, is this one? Yeah, it was. Go upstairs. Oh my god. It's a Pokemon? The God Center. And we have a Nugget. All right, wait, which one is this? We have revives here and max potions and ultra balls. Yeah, I, we're gonna spend everything we have because uh, we're definitely gonna white out sometime soon. Okay, let's do the rest of Vernon. You know what? Actually, let's not do the rest of Vernon Turf Town. We're not going to. Let's continue our playthrough from Old Ale Town and beat our rival. <laughs> We've been playing this for almost two hours and we still haven't gotten our Pokedex. And we also have the first gym badge. <laughs> we'll mud shot you, yeah. Nice. Head back to the lab. You know what? I think it might be really funny if we just never get the Pokedex. Maybe we just don't. All right. So we got a couple more entrances here. Oh, that's actually very convenient. And then we have uh, the last one right here. Get me out! I don't want to be here! <laughs> oh, the last of the Pokemon Elite Four. Yeah, I know. That was cool, man. So now we got to remember that last member of the Elite Four is also in Verdon Turf City. Okay, so we've done all of Verdon Turf. Do we check out Fortree first or Mauville first? Probably Fortree. Okay, that's really nice. All right, let's do Mauville now. So this leads us to Verdon Turf. This one is different. That's a, a real Pokemon. Wow, what are the odds? <laughs> Oh, it's a one way. Okay, hopefully we can get back. Wait, we know this one. This one's good, actually. What's up, Shop It? How it go? How it do? Do we catch the Shop It? Ultra Ball. Nice. Shop It was caught. All right, now we're back in Zootopolis. Right, right, right. The Zootopolis to Fortree. And now we can get back to Mauville, and we're all good to go. Right, let's check the daycare. Okay, what is in store? We're still looking for gym number two, by the way. All right, what's in here? Oh, it's a Pokemon Center. Uh, did we go in this one? Wait, I'm sorry. Are they both Pokemon Centers? Okay. There's two centers back to back here. This is where they've been hiding. Pacific Log Town. Right. We haven't been there yet. Oh, you want to get a bike chat? Yes. Give me a bike. All right. That's pretty good so far. Oh, this is the entrance to Sky Pillar. We're getting closer to, to Rayquaza, guys. Oh, the door's closed, though. Okay, at least we found one of the Elite Four members. I don't know if we can beat him, though. Try it once. Yeah, I'll try it once. Go, Shugma! Use Curse! A little underleveled here. Oh, my God. Because the Pacific Log Pokemon Center was the last one. Oh, we're out of the loop now. So we need to somehow get back to the main loop. Which we can do right here. Yeah, and then we're back to Mauville. Okay. Go heal you monster. Yeah, we gotta find a Pokemon Center again. That's the issue about this mod, right? It's like, we need to find Pokemon Centers. Hey, can I get past here? So we have to head back. We haven't actually gone up to here yet. With our rival battle and all. So let's try from the right to left. Hey, we'll take a fossil though. Yeah, Dittos aren't gonna do an us any justice here though. All right, so this is gym six. So we know the location of three, four, six, and eight. Okay, so we have two options here. We can escape rope here, I think, or we can die. 
Well, escape rope. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, we actually can't. All right, let's white out. For real. Hey, look, we're in Oldale. Wow, you teleported too. That's crazy, man. Okay, so we did this one. So this one is different. It's Meteor Falls, but we're in... I think this leads us back. Oh. Oh, God. And he fights me. All right, Maxi, it's on! Yeah, Maxi. Um, hey, man. Maybe we uh, take it a little easy on me, all right? Also, I'm like 90% sure this is a soft lock anyways, so we're just going to... Oh, hey, it's real. I don't know if we can actually beat him at this point. We had glitched in the teleport mod. We need to catch higher level Pokemon. We could go to Victory Road. Oh, Victory Road. Okay, perfect. Okay, Golbat. Chat, what are the chances now of me catching this Golbat? Half health, level 42, Ultra Bowl. 50%? Let's make it better than 50. Okay, please work. I've sold my entire life savings for this. Yes! We got it! Now you use that to catch a Sableye. I mean, we do have one more ball. Uh, Larion. Do we get the Larion? I give it a shot. Okay, here we go. Ultra ball. Please catch. Oh, that's huge. Oh my God. We're so poor. All right, so guys, our Pokemon party consists currently of Shugma, Ligmud, Gulpin, Hobat, and Leon. Beautiful. Okay, now that we've done that, I think we have enough power to defeat our rival. All right, so Tropius. Oh, this is a bad matchup. This is a really bad matchup. Um, Roar. This is also a really bad matchup. Roar. <laughs> Uh, this is also a really bad matchup. I give up! So, like I said uh, previously, this was a really good matchup. I'm glad we didn't use Roar. That would be dumb. Dude, this Pelipper with Mist is the worst thing I've ever seen in my entire life. There we go. Thank you. And we finally defeat our rival. We got to see what's inside of this mall now. Literally, that's the only reason why we did all of this. It was a one way. Let's go up here. Oh. Right, the Aqua Hideout. Oh! Wait, this is the other entrance to Gym 8. Because the ladder brings us to the abandoned ship, right? Okay, falling down the ice. Okay, it's actually the gym. It's still like a one-way because this next ladder is different. All right, so we go in here. Oh, that's huge! We haven't been to Lava Ridge yet. Okay, new area. Island Cave. So this is just another warp. Oh, it's the lap one. Hey! All right. At least there's more warps here. Yeah, there's one at least here. Oh, that's lovely. Hey, we got HMO6. Rock smash. All right, that gives us more access to like everything. Oh, I need badge three. We need to find the second gym, dude. All right, so that's the island cave. So now let's explore this abandoned ship over here. All right, so we just came out of the broken door. That's good. Oh, we can check all of Petalburg now. Dude, that's fantastic. Another Pokemon Center. All right, well, we don't need this one. Uh, you can never leave. You're stuck forever. So abandoned ship goes to Rustboro, and then Rustboro leads to Slateport. And if you go back, it leads to the Aqua Hideout. So let's go into uh, this one. I mean, we can go back easily. Okay, Pedalburg City. Let's see what's in Pedalburg. Gym 2. Pokemon Center. <laughs> no, no. What's going on, BB? At least we found the Elite Four, though. Okay, so we're back in Lily Cove. Okay, we haven't been here yet. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> All right, guys. Time to catch a Mew. <laughs> Please, like, defense up. Shadow Ball's okay. I also hope I don't kill you. This could definitely... Uh... Okay. Be Great Ball here now. Yes! 
Well, we caught Mew. Uh, that's not the second gym, though. Okay. So we've already been uh, all the way over there, but we haven't checked this house. Um, what if I talk to him? Sky Pillar, that's it. It must be the Sky Pillar. Okay. Oh! He opens up Sky Pillar, though. That's another warp. Oh. Wait. <laughs> we've unlocked the story now. So I'm going to Lily Cove right now. And then once we're at Lily Cove, then the Pokemon Center is Sky Pillar. Yes. Yeah, we're literally end game right now. That's crazy. But this is a new warp, though. Oh. Hey, fancy seeing you again. Dude, it's literally the other door. All right, so now we're at Pacific Log, and then we go back to Lily Cove. That's crazy, too, because now Lily Cove's storming. <laughs> Forgot about that. How did we exit Petalburg? You heal there and die. Right. Which is perfect, because I know just the woman to bother. <laughs> okay, we're back in Lily Cove. And then this is to Sky Pillar. Okay, which one is this? Oh, I need Rock Smash? Oh, but wait, I can't use Rock Smash, though. Because I need the badge! Hey, what's up, Phoebe? <laughs> nice. Okay. I mean, I, we can go to Old Dale Town, probably. Oh, right. I forgot. We still haven't gotten our Pokedex. Anyways, let's just continue on. Yeah. Oh, the Wind Stray House. You're right. You're right. Forgot about that. Okay. Okay. We found the last Elite Four member. So we know where they all are. Uh, Time to die, though. So if we can continue going left here, this is all new. I hate granite. Explore the cave. Is it time for us to finally explore the caves? All right, all right, all right. I'll explore the caves. Okay, granite cave. Let's get lost. Oh. Hey, we're in the department store. This is new. So the big thing about the department store is that we can kind of go to any floor. Uh, all right, so third floor left, which is Mount Pyre. Which one haven't we done? You went up. Okay, so we got to go this one. Oh, this is the Evergrande City Pokemon Center. Oh, the Elite Four entrance as well. Oh, no, but they do a badge check, so we can't. Meteor Falls. Let's check Meteor Falls while we're at it. We found Jim too! Oh my god, it's been hours! It was right there! We can finally go all the way up to Gym 6. Okay, I'm Brawly, Duford's gym leader. All right, finally. We're just gonna go through it. Iron Tail, Iron Tail. Dude, I've been waiting my whole entire life for this moment. I should probably level up my other Pokemon too. Anyways, we received the Knuckle Badge. And we can use Flash 2 and TM8. We can't use Rock Smash until we beat Gym 3 though. So where's Gym 3 again? It's one of these that's the third gym. Let's go! What's up, Watson? Okay, so... I know we're steel type, but we're also level 48. So like, hear me out. And then I think I know exactly where the next gym is too. Let's go. We got some cash and the third badge. Yeah, now we can use rock smash out of battle, which is somehow the most incredible thing. All right, let's do the fourth gym now. It's this one. Yes, there we go. Okay, Flannery. Well, you up. Thank you. All right, now we've gotten the fourth gym badge and now we can use strength if we ever get it. <laughs> and now we just need to go back to Rustboro. I like how like now that we've found the second gym, we're like cascading to all of the other gyms. Okay, dad. All right, gym five now. All right, Iron Tail. Yeah, this is like we're overpowered, dude. Oh boy. And we defeated Leader Norman. That's bad. HM move Surf will be able to travel over water. Dude, once we get Surf, it's all over. Ah, there you are. Please come with me. I have something you need to have. I'd like you to have this. Strength. Surf. I mean, surf. It's literally surf. I lied. So now we need to get to gym number six. Top right house. Because we go down here. But I can't actually do this because it does soft lock me. Okay. So the sixth gym was locked behind a one-way entrance. I could enter in this way, but not exit out. The issue is that once I beat the gym leader, I'd have no way to exit out of the actual gym back into the world. I'd have to find some sort of solution. That's when genius struck out of nowhere, and I started devising a plan. How do you teleport out of a situation like this? Clearly, teleport and escape ropes don't work. But what's another case where you warp to another location? 
Ah, yeah, death. <laughs> Only in death will Pokemon truly spawn new life. Socrates, uh, probably. Anyways, alrighty, boys. Alrighty, girls. Let's get poisoned. If we strategically poison one of our Pokemon during a double battle and end the last gym leader fight with only that poisoned Pokemon in our party left standing, we can walk around until we white out, spawning us at our most recently visited center. So we teleport out. Yes! Wait. Hey, Grill, it's been a while. How's it going? No! No! Our rival battle! <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Go goggles. Cool. Yeah, yeah. You go fight Norman. Okay, we're good. No battle. Okay, we're fine. We did it. We managed to not lock, and we had the sixth gym badge. Cool. We have six badges, but we don't know where the seventh gym is. We know where the eighth gym is. We know where all four of the Elite Four trainers are and the champion. All we need to do is now find the seventh gym, and we're good to go. That's it. You know where we haven't been yet? We haven't been to the left yet, and we haven't been to the Weather Institute. Oh, we have a rival battle. I forgot. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. So Brendan has like somehow lost Pokemon and the Pokemon have like gone down levels. That's crazy how that works. We're all good. Everything's fine. Oh, we got fly now. Okay. So we use fly. Go back to Fortress, sure. I'll be real with you. It seems a little cheap. Let's be fair. We'll not use fly. Oh, I can't actually go to the weather instead. I know I have to go from the other side, but we'll figure it out. Right. Oh, so Weather Institute's up here. Okay. I think I might start checking, like, things that we've done before, because we can go back and, like, do Rock Smash and Surf now. We can, like, unlock things. Oh, hey! I have some Pokeballs. I can't believe we just got Reggie. What? All right. Just ball it. Okay. One, two, three! Let's go! Regirog! Dude, what do we name it? I feel like Reggie is just like maybe a little bit too crass. <laughs> just blur out the name. All right. Nice. So that's what the Weather Institute had. Where can we look? We need to look into like Victory Road. Okay, so we haven't been here. Okay, well, that's strength. Yeah, where do we get strength from? You have the strength from the guy in Rusturf Tunnel. Oh, we do have Rusturf Tunnel. The Duford Pokemon Center is to Rusturf Tunnel. All right, now we use Rock Smash. Ha ha! Look, now we've saved you guys. And now we have strength. Okay, let's go. All right, so we'll go back down to here, which is so weird. The game is such a weird state because we still haven't like beat Maxi or Archie and we haven't found Rayquaza yet. So it's like raining and then not raining all at the same time. Kind of funny, actually. Where else, dude? Nice coding. This is Rayquaza, dude. I think it's story first, though. I think we have to come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awaken Rayquaza flew up. All right, so if we go back now to Sutopolis. Yes! Cool. All right, so now if we go back to there. Let's go. All right, let's do the Master Ball. Go. Oh, oh, oh. oh my God. We caught it. That's pretty cool. It literally doesn't help us in the short run at all. The long run, we'll be able to beat the Elite Four really fast. Oh, this is new. This is new. Actually, yeah. I, have we been here? I don't think we have. No, we have not. Uh, hi, Lugia. All right, let me lower you down. Hey, chat. Wouldn't it be crazy if we got this first try? Dude, dude, please. Yes! I can't believe we got that first try. Nice. Now on to our, our quest to find the seventh gym. Maybe we should just like start rechecking literally every single like city. Just want to make sure we can cross off Moss Deep. Oh, we finally found the seventh gym. I don't even know how to get out, man. Chat, how do we get out though? Are we going to do the poison stride again? All righty, let's do the poison strat. So basically we're gonna make Luigi die during the fight and then have Rayquaza be the last one standing. So then we can get rid of the soft lock and die outside of the fight here. All right. Okay, so now we're on last one here. And now Rayquaza, extreme speed again on Luigi to kill. Okay, we'll Oren Berry, I guess, and then fly on Luigi. 
Oh, psychic will work too. Thanks, Lunatone. Okay, now I just outrage, I think. We did it! Tate and Liza, seventh gym badge down. And then we white out and teleport back to the nearest Pokemon Center. Woo! Freedom! Okay, so now to the abandoned ship. There it is. Here we go. Hey, oh, what's going on? Leader one. Yeah, we're just going to one shot. <laughs> like, yeah, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And we get a level. And that is the eighth gym. Let's go. All right, now on to the Elite Four. Okay. All right, let's go, dude. Elite Four Sydney would like to battle. And we just extreme speed, honestly. He's just really underleveled. All right, this is the last Pokemon, anyways. KO. Let's go. First Elite Four member down. Now go to the next room and enjoy your next battle. Oh, shh. Oh, that's another warp. Okay, Route 104, we'll take it. And we're in Petalburg. Like, we need to go to Phoebe anyways, right? So Phoebe, as we know, is literally anywhere. So if we just go into our random house, we'll probably just find Phoebe. Um, found her. What's the warp? The Phoebe warp from the bottom? Okay, Desert Ruins, the one way. Oh, yeah, dude. All right, we'll just outrage. Kill? Yes. I feel like if we just keep outraging, we'll be fine. Let's go. Dude, we're sweeping. I still can't believe they made the legendary level 70. I never got that. Because you just catch Rayquaza, and then you just carry the rest of the game. And we've gotten the second member of the Elite Four. Nice. All right, perfect. So two Elite Four members down. Where's the third? Marvel Route 111, Win Straight House. All right, this is Elite Four member number three, Glacia. Honestly? Oh, they're all ice. So we still should one shot with the outrage. Kill. Thank you. All right, that's good. We're all good. Pack it up, guys. This should kill. Ah, oh, close though. Okay. I thought we would go uh, without Rayquaza dying here. Oh, we're frozen. Yo, can we stop this? Let's um max revive Rayquaza. I think. I didn't realize that this was literally my Kryptonite. Okay. Now we outrage, and this theoretically should kill. Let's go. And that's Glacia. Okay, we need to do the last one. Which, oh, wait. Oh my God, we're done. Cause right here is Drake. And then the champion's right there. Oh my God, let's full send. Wow. All right, we just outrage it. We're set, dude, we're set. Oh, Dragon Claw's not gonna kill, but it's gonna do a lot of damage. It's actually gonna kill. It's actually not gonna do a lot of damage because we're still gonna survive that. <laughs> uh, We're good. Kingdra's uh, also Dragon type. Nice, and we one shot. So cool. We, I don't even think we need to catch Lugia. I'll be real with you. Go onwards. All right. And finally, face the champion. Literally the champion we found before any gym leader, before anyone. All right. Let's beat the champion once and for all. Are we just outrage? Okay. Nice. Yeah, let's just outrage again. Yeah, no, no, no. But like, what if we outrage like one more time though? Never mind. Okay. Just as planned, I wanted to make sure that we died there. Uh, so we can, like, reset the bit flip RNG value. All right, what TMs do we have, though? We have Shockwave. Shockwave to Luigi. So when Melota comes out, we'll just do that. Nice. Okay, so now I'm going to Shockwave here. I should do at least a little bit of damage. Oh, it's so close, dude. Stop, re stop recovering! Stop! Are you serious? Thank you! We got a crit! And we'll, okay, and then wing attack should kill. Nice. And then we'll psychic and hope to kill. It's setting up. Let's go! We defeated champion Wallace! You know what's the craziest thing about all of this? We never got our Pokedex. <laughs> hey, and look at our team. Rayquazzac, Luigi, Abra, Reggie, Hopat, and Leon. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. League champion, congratulations. And there you have it, Pokemon Emerald beaten with the entire map, completely changed and randomized. If you want to play this for yourself, join my Discord, links are in the description and everywhere else, and there should be a channel there where you can download it. It's absolutely free, and we're going to constantly update it so you can randomize the map of basically every generation. Subscribe to the channel so you're notified of when things come out, and I'll see you in another video.